Playing an AI character in Westworld makes me constantly think about what's created and what's real. The honorees tonight show us that science and mathematics are beautiful worlds in themselves, infinite amusement parks for the mind. And they're also key in comprehending our real world and how we can change it for the better. Our next laureate is deeply committed to both of those worlds. He's pledged to devote a large part of his time to mathematical research that could help our planet in the fight against climate change. And at other times, he enters a world of pure abstraction. Let's take a glimpse at what it's like to live there. The concepts of space and symmetries are central in mathematics. Mathematicians first have to make conjectures, which are guesses on what should be true, and often the conjectures are very difficult. Then they have to find new ideas to prove these conjectures. My interest in mathematics began at uh, four or five, and before I learned to write. It was a passion I really liked to do it. I was interested in all big questions of arithmetic, and in particular the Riemann hypothesis and the Langlands program. When I began to work on the Langlands program, I tried most of the main conjectures, and I failed on most, all of them. And finally, the result I obtained was not the one I was looking for. Mathematicians are driven by curiosity and beauty. They should have the innocence of children who do not hesitate to ask simple questions and are not afraid of discovering something different from what is expected. We are curious about hidden truths. We rely on intuition, dreams, visions, and analogies. The beauty of mathematics relies in the harmony of the different parts and the way we discover unexpected things. groundbreaking contributions to several areas of mathematics, in particular to the Langlands program in the functional field case. The Breakthrough Prize for Mathematics is awarded to Vincent Laforgue. Vincent Laforgue likes to spend his free time hiking in the foothills of the Alps. I thank my teachers and colleagues and my institution in France, the CNRS. The beauty of mathematics is eternal. Unfortunately, the beauty of our planet is in great danger. This place reminds us of the great success of the Apollo program. Today, to save our planet, we need such a collective effort for basic research and research and development for clean energy. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>